Hello. What's up? All right. So, uh, when I was, I'm just going to mention this because I think it's funny. By the way, I woke up not that long ago. I look drowsy. I always look drowsy. I'm very drowsy. <laughs> I'm tired. Oh, man. Anyways, yeah. Hi. So, I just want to mention this because I think it's hilarious. I was changing the, like, stream info and stuff, you know, how you do. So, I was doing that. And then, uh, when I was changing the tags to be for Stardew Valley instead of uh, Skyrim. By the way, we're playing Stardew Valley. Yay. But, uh, yeah, when I was doing that, it still said stealth. Because, you know, it takes a second for it to actually, like, update. Like, as soon as you change the game, it doesn't actually immediately change the tags on there, like, right after. So I did that, and it still said stealth. And I was like, what? Like, that was the first word that I read. And I was like, that shouldn't be a tag for Stardew Valley. That doesn't make any sense. And I was really confused. And then I remembered, and I was like, oh, right. That's for <laughs> that's for Skyrim. That makes sense. Right. <laughs> yeah, that confused me a lot. I was like, Stardew Valley doesn't have stealth mechanics. What? What are you talking about? <laughs> All right. Anyways, hi. So... I think I mentioned this in another stream, just vaguely, about, like, the thing that I wanted to do. I'm, like, fixing my hair, but it cannot be fixed. It's just a mess. Whatever. Anyways, I was talking about it in another stream, about how I watched a Call Me Kevin video about him doing... He's, like, doing a series of videos right now of, like, staying in one chunk in Minecraft, and also in Stardew, staying in the, um the farm and never leaving except for once a year apparently is the new development and I kind of want to do that but like instead of just once a year because that sounds a little bit boring in my opinion and I want to be able to just fuck around and have fun in the game I'm going to do it three times a season I think like the first day of a season this last day of a season and the holiday basically is what I'm thinking so that's when I'm going to go into town and the only times I will go into town because you know, I thought that'd be fun. So that's what we're doing. Yeah, so let's get started. I will pop that up and I will get... To oh, wait. Ooh. Ooh. Wait, I can do some things. Let me go over here and pull up the thing, the remote control. I remember, Pepperidge Farm remembers how to use the remote on my phone so I can control the stream on my phone instead of worrying about it on my laptop because hotkeys are hard uh where the fuck is the remote there it is Ooh, is it still attached is it am i still attached it is awesome i'm so smart all right <laughs> anyways but now i can keep an eye on it and i can just change it over when it's ready to change over and hopefully it'll be fine right Stardew Valley will get captured on there. Right? I don't have to worry about it, do I? Do I? I'm a little concerned. Wait. Well, I can check. So, hopefully it'll be fine. It should be fine. Oop, shit. I clicked it too early. A little bit too preemptive. Uh, we wait for it to load. Hopefully it'll be fine. I really hope it's fine. This is the first time I'm using the remote really properly during the stream. Oop. It's up. It's here. I can check. Wait. I can just look on the stream from my phone and to see if it's working. We'll see. Is it fine? <laughs> Y'all are just here for the journey of me figuring out ah, how this all works. I didn't. No, it did. It just took a second. Okay, the game looks like it's been captured. But also, why is this muted? What is happening? Oh, fuck. <laughs> I still have to leave. Oh no, I messed up. <laughs> I messed up all of the things. Shit. <laughs> Hang on. The audio's all wonked. No, don't go through there. Go through here so I can hear what's happening. I want to be able to hear the audio too. You can just see me moving the mouse as I try to get all of the properties and things sorted in the background. Done. Where's the audio? 
There isn't audio. What the fuck? Why isn't there audio? What is happening? Laptop! <laughs> What's going on? Why? I clicked the right settings. Right? Yeah. What? Stardew! Exit. Hang on. Now I have to do this all over again. What the hell is happening? Why? Does everything I touch break? <laughs> Why doesn't the stream just work? <sighs> Sag. Oh! Alright, it's fine now. Cool. Awesome. Fantastic. Alright. The stream should be fine. It should be fine now. Now I can just see the chat over there. And just leave it going. Okay. Jeez. We're playing Stardew. Is the audio fine, by the way? It feels a little bit loud, but I feel like it's probably okay. Like... Ah, it's probably fine. It's probably fine. It's probably fine. Alright. Uh, we want a new game. So. He used the beach farm, but I don't know if it's like... Good foraging and fishing. Tons of open space. Sometimes supply crates wash up. However, sprinklers don't work in the sandy soil. That's annoying. Land is divided into four parcels. Don't need that. Wilderness. There's plenty of good land here, but beware. At night, the monsters come out. Uh, hilltop farm. Rocky terrain. Rind winding river. Make it difficult to design your farm. However, a mineral deposit provides mining opportunities. Hmm. Forest farm. Woods limit your farming space. The bounty of the forest is nearly at your doorstep. Land is spread across several islands and scenic riverbanks. Fish are more common here than usual. And a standard farm, which isn't super useful. I'm, like, uncertain. I'm torn between the riverland, the forest, and the hilltop. I've never used the wilderness one, but I don't think it, like, really helps me. I'm turning the volume down, because holy fucking shit, it's so loud. I don't know why, but, like, it is so loud. It's so loud. At least for me. Like, it's super loud. Okay, anyways. <laughs> right. So, anyways. Um. I always use the forest farm. That's, like, always the one that I pick. Without doubt. This is irritating me. I'm moving the microphone. I'm sorry for the microphone sounds as I move this. Okay. It's just <laughs> getting on my nerves, just quietly. Hi. It should be fine. You're alright. Everything's fine. <laughs> I moved the I moved the laptop a little. It's fine. Alright, anyways, yeah. So, I mean, fishing is not going to be a thing I'm able to do until, like, the end of the month. So, meh. The forest farm is good. It does have a lot of, like good forest things that you can get out of it. And it definitely regrows trees pretty fast. Mm. And the mineral deposit provides mining opportunities, which is good, but... And it does have a winding river, so it says. Mm. Well, now I'm torn between these two, because I don't think I really need the Riverland one. So I want Hilltop or Forest. So, like, I can't go mining, is the thing. So, would H Hilltop be better? But I can't really get, like, the, uh, the foresty materials as easily if it's just from here. Not until I'm able to get the seeds. Ooh. Maybe Hilltop is better, because later on, if I'm lucky, I can get those seasonal seeds if I just find enough of the things in, like, the singular- the few days that I have during the month where I actually go out. Yeah, because I do have three days for each season, basically. And, like, one of them is meant to be for the festival stuff, but, like, it still allows me to, like, go out and everything. So, I'm thinking that- this could be a good shout, doing the hilltop farm. I've never done the hilltop farm. I think that'll be fine. Alright, so. 
Sarah Lynn, farm name. Um, Kendrith. I already, I always use this as a name for places. Favorite thing. Um, what is my favorite thing? Hmm, this is a hard question. Cats, <laughs> I guess. I like cats. Cats are cool. And I'm gonna get a cat. And I don't super care about the design, I guess. Uh, do I like that? Uh, uh, do I want long hair in this or nah? That's the real question. Hmm. Oh wow, that's fun. I'm kind of in the mood for floof hair. <laughs> Might stick with that for the time being. I'm gonna skip the intro because nobody gives a shit about your dying grandfather. Um, let's change the shirt. I'm up for this. I think this will look fun. <laughs> and maybe some washed out a little. Just a tad. Yeah, sure. I'm going for something here. I think it's cute. Let's go a little bit lighter, maybe? No. No. We go a bit darker for the eyes. Alright, sure. <laughs> Why not? Yeah. Alright. So, we're going with the challenge. We're gonna do the thing. Using the chat in the, like... Streamlabs controller makes me nervous because a part of me is like worried. <laughs> okay. Ooh. This is fun. Whoop. Picked up the TV. Didn't mean to do that. I need to remember the controls. <laughs> it's gonna be sunny. Fortune teller. Hi. Right. Leave it off the land. Forage. Yep. <laughs> Definitely a thing that I can do. What is this? It's just a small crystal. Interesting. Right. Yes. I know. Received 15 parsnip seeds. Here's a little something to get you started. Mayor Lewis. Thanks, Lewis. Cold spade harvest parsnip. 20 people greeted. Right. Okay. Well, I can actually leave today. So, I want to do something real fast. Where am I going to plant things? Here, I guess. I need to quickly run and just check things out in my first day and take advantage of the fact that I'm allowed to leave today and today only for like a while. So I'm not going to be able to go anywhere for like a bit of time. So I'm just going to do some of these. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Seeds. Let's go over one. Bonk. Seed. And we can do... Boop. Okay. I'm going to chop down a tree. I just need enough wood to get, like, a chest so I can just toss all of these things into it because I need to be able to have a free inventory so that I can go and run and grab as many things as possible from town that I am able to grab. How much does it cost? It costs 50, right? Yeah. Okay. We must be fast. This is moderately stressful. This is probably going to be like one of the most stressful days of the month. Because like, I actually have to, you know, go and do things. I feel like I enjoy the idea of not having to leave the farm for like a while. So I'm just going to do the really stressful thing of leaving the farm immediately. And just do it really fast. That way I don't have to worry about it for like, a while. <laughs> okay. Go over here. I'm going to make myself a chest. Put that there. Leave that. Put this here for now. And then toss, 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 toss. We don't need those. Well, actually, we probably do need that. Yeah, okay. And I'm going to organize this real fast. Boop. Boop, 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 boop. There. Okay. Moving on. All right. Let's go into town. We can greet some people, but our main priority is to go and just pick up any nice materials that we can find. We want forageables. We want various objects. We really want forageables, though, like, particularly, because once we forage enough with, like, other stuff, then we can make the uh, seeds for the season. 
which is super useful because then we can just make a ton of forageables, you know? So I'm not going to sell them. I'm just going to hold on to them. I'm just going to hold on to a lot of things because that's how I play my games usually. All right, let's wander around here. Get these because we want to try and get some seeds. Duncan, what? Seeds. Garchet, what? Sorry, that's a Yogg's reference. Don't worry about it. Anyways. <laughs> yeah, just going to... Man, I feel like half of the day is already come and gone, and I don't have time to do anything. I'm filled with fear. This is shockingly stressful as I'm trying to just quickly run around and do as much as I possibly can. Okay, we're running. We're running, we're running, we're running. I need to come down here and look at some things. Okay, hi, 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 hi. Hey. Alright, I'm coming in here. I'm getting some things from Pierre's. Hi, people. Greeting. Hello there. I'm Gus. Chef. Yep. Hi, Gus. Hi, Marnie. May I lose to when you be here? Hello, hello, hello. Alright. Do we want to get seeds? We do want to get seeds. Because this is like a first time investment of us being here. Man, I wish. <laughs> we could afford trees. Alright, so we want to pick up whatever seeds we can for this first time through, you know? But we want, like, hard-to-get seeds. Seeds that we would not normally get, but, like, for a good price. So maybe, like, tulips? Tulips go for a decent amount. Ooh, but bean starters, though. Oh, man. Bean starters are a good investment because then we can have a lot of bean. Ooh. But how much bean? That's the real question. How much are we going to get for bean? I want at least one. Okay, so I want at least one bean. Do I want to try and get these? They're so expensive is the thing with these ones and I can always get mixed seeds and I can't come back so I have to just like do the investment maybe three three bean okay I have to think super hard about this and make sure that I get really good ones oh man this is rough okay um oh, man I'm really tempted to get cauliflower because I know but also parsnip is a really solid one I can just get more parsnips. I can just get a ton of parsnips because you need a lot of parsnips for a lot of the like the building, you know. I could just buy all parsnip and just go in on parsnips. Oh, I'm just gonna go in on parsnips. I went all in on parsnips. 16 parsnip seeds. All right. Did I greet Pierre? No. Hey, looking for seeds. Yeah, I know. Okay, bye very low priority to meet everybody but I do want to try and get that out of the way just because I feel like I should hey guy hey pleasure to meet you hi Harvey bye Harvey I'm gonna go I have other things to worry about I have to go down this way because this is also a place where we can get possibly mixed seeds we want seeds seeds mixed seeds seed give just fiber Ooh, a flower. Hello. Hi, Sam. Move, Sam. Hi. Hello. I don't care that you're disgusted. I need these things. Hey. Hi, Penny. Alright. Is there anything on the beach that I can get? It's just the small beach right now, so there shouldn't be a lot. Hey, guy. What's your name again? Elliot. Hi. I'm Elliot. Live in a little cabin. Yeah, I know. Bye, Elliot. There shouldn't be anything on the beach, really. This is just the first day. Oop. A cockle. Oop. Cool. Alright. It's already noon. I'm so scared. I'm filled with fear. Like, <laughs> there's, like, nothing happening. But, like, I'm so scared about making sure that I actually do this properly. Like... Damn, there's so many dandelions. What the hell? Dandelions? Daffodils. Lol? Mmm, stupid. Don't worry about it. Trash. Trash. Ooh, a bar. Cool. Hi. Yeet. Alright, bye. Old people. Hello. Hi. Yes, George. Hi, George. You're my favorite. Hello, Evelyn. George is only my favorite because he's easy to please. Because he just likes leeks. So... <laughs> He's very easy to feed. Alright. Uh, I 
I have no things. I have no room. Wait, I know you. Mer, hi. Yep, hi, bye. <laughs> Running. Man, this is this is nerve wracking. It's already 1.30. Like, I am running out of time. I do not have the time to be going around doing things. I just have to rush and run. The thing is making me nervous. I don't know. <laughs> it's making me scared. I don't even know if the stream is still going. Just looking at the remote chat. So I'm just going to do it on here. That makes me feel a little bit better. All right, cool. So I can confirm that the stream is actually going. And my computer is not getting too hot, so we should be fine. Moving on. Okay. Store. We're going to store all of our things right now. And worry about it later. All right. Let's go up first. Because down is like a ways to go, you know? God, let me through. Oh my god. Scoot. Okay. We're going up this way. I am so scared. <laughs> Why is this so terrifying? Why is this so stressful? It would be nice if you could consider this area like another place in the farm, but I'm not going to cheat. That would feel like cheating. I'm already adding in like extra days where I can actually leave. Stranger, hello. Hi. Linus is good company. He's chill. You can just give him whatever. Horseradish, fantastic. Am I missing one of the things? It's leeks, daffodils, horseradish. Isn't there something else? Or is it just those? I feel like there's something else, but I also am not entirely certain. Hi. Greetings. Hi. I'm just going to say hey to Robin, just in case. Hello. Nope. I have a few people left in meeting. I don't remember exactly how many, but I have a few. But that's okay. Who cares about meeting everybody when we can go and do other things? Prioritize. Okay. And we're going down here, and we're going to go over here. Because there's some stuff we want to get. Not in Jojo Mart. We already spent all of our stuff, and I don't care about the stuff in there. I want to get this. Bonk. Seeds! Yes. Isn't there, like, a thing here? Yes. There's another block of wood. We want to get as many resources in these areas as possible. So all of the trash cans that we can do, we want to do. Did someone just come out? Hey! Stop! Hey, Pam. Bye, Pam. I think I missed being able to greet Shane. I'm not entirely certain. Bonk. We can see Clint! Ah. Damn it, I missed it. Right. I can't see Clint. Not unless I go by the thing later. I can do that. Yoink. Does anything happen if I go in here? Trash. Nice. Hi. Yes, I know. I'm not even going to read it. I'm just rushing so that I can get back home. Just trying to be fast. Okay. I'm going to drop all of these things off. Hey, Maru. Maru? Right? Yes. Yo. Bye. Are they open in the saloon? Are there people in the saloon? Can I go say hi? I can. I can say hi to Emily. Real fast. Hey. Don't care. I don't care about what any of them have to say. I'm just skipping all of the dialogue to quickly run through, grab what I need, and go home. Just running. Hey, Harvey. It's passing by. Is it? Man, I don't remember if there are any other forageables besides, like, spring onions, I guess. Which I'm going to go and retrieve on this one day when I'm able to do so. Alright, we only got to make seeds out of all of the things that we broke, which is a little unfortunate. Oh, man, I have no idea where the way down is. Is it here? Is this it? Is it this way? No. How the fuck? Oh, Jesus Christ. I'm getting lost. I'm wasting time by going this way. I'm wasting time by going this way. I'm just gonna go around 
I dislike having to do that, but I'm going I don't know where the entrance is down there. I just know that it's vaguely down and that doesn't help me much. Okay. And it's already 7 p.m. I don't have time. This time constraint is terrifying. I'm so scared. <laughs> this will be the last day I'm able to go out until the egg festival and I can't really do a whole lot on the egg festival day. Except for go to the egg festival. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna see if there's a lot of people that I can just greet in here real fast. Wah. Hey. Shane's here. I can greet Shane. Hello. Bye. How many people have I greeted? Oh, wait a second. Man, I got most of them. <laughs> I don't have to worry about it. I'm doing that for my own satisfaction just because it irritates me not having, like, finished that, I guess. So what's her face in here? She is. I can go read her real fast. I know that I don't have a lot of time, but like... Hey, Haley. I just wanna... I should just spawn. I just wanna take care of it while I can, you know? So that I don't have to worry about it, because it'll irritate me later. They're closing at 8. Right. Man, I missed meeting out Clint. I'll have to check him later. Okay, now we have to go and pick up as much as we can from this area. This is the only time we can really go over here for a while. Alright, we're gonna see if there are any spring onions. Hopefully there are, at least like a couple. Not that I can use them for a whole lot at the moment, because like, it's not like they're easy to get like as a treat or anything, but you know. Can try and eat a couple. Horseradish. Nice. Or at least like sell them, I guess. They might be better used as like selling. Considering. I don't see anything over here. It's getting dark. It's harder to see. I'm trying to keep an eye out, see if there's anything. But I might miss it because it's dark. This is the real gold mine, is trying to get more mixed seeds by going around and breaking these things. I'm not even going to worry about like the wood and stuff. Because I need to prioritize getting things done. If I have time, I can chop down some trees, I think. But I really need to try and get some mixed seeds out of this. If I'm really lucky, I'll at least get like one somewhere. I can't see. It's dark. <laughs> Ah, uh, the day is coming to a close. And I don't know how to get back to my house from down here. Hey, I got some. Alright, cool. It's worth it if I can at least get one mixed seed. I can't fucking see. <laughs> There's a horseradish up here. I got a couple mixed seeds. Man, it is really hard to see where I'm going. It's so dark. Man, after you, like, play with the the fucking light ring or whatever when you eventually get that in the game, it gets, like, noticeably more difficult to see what the fuck you're doing when you play through without it, in my opinion. Because you get so used to it and being like, yeah, I can totally see when I go out at night. And you're like, yeah, it's fine. It's just midnight. I can still see. But, like, then you do it without the light ring and you're like, what the fuck? It's so dark. You just forget how legitimately dark it is without that ring. Okay. Now it's just this section, and then I have to go back home. I really don't want to pass out, so I'm probably going to have to go all the way around in order to make sure I actually can get back to my house. I don't know how to access it otherwise. Alright, well, that's all I can get out of this. It's getting late, so I have to run. Just sprint my way all the way around because I don't trust myself to navigate through this new format of house that I do not understand. We got a lot of forageables on the very first day, and we cannot come back. After this day, we must remain within our home until, like, the fucking egg festival? And then the very last day of spring, and the first day of summer. I'm doing that specifically because, like, 
I don't remember when certain things are open on which of those days. So, oh, it's nice in here. Yep. That's it. That's the first day. And that's the only time we're allowed to leave for a while. So the next time we'll be leaving is during the Egg Festival. I got foraging leveled up. That's pretty dope. And I can make the wild seeds for spring. That's awesome. Okay. What do they cost? Daffodil leek. Dandelions are what I'm missing. I didn't find any dandelions. I said it earlier. Shit. I have everything but dandelions. That's really annoying. <laughs> Man, weather report. It's gonna rain. That's nice. Fortune teller. Somewhat perturbed today. Cool to know. Alright. Well. Just got back from a fishing trip. Can't. <laughs> will when I can, but I cannot at the moment, really. Well, that's that. <laughs> I'm gonna put all of my seeds down now. Should I put all of them, all of them? I can. <laughs> I can. That's a thing I can do. Should I eat the field snack? Oh man, now I'm concerned because I have constraints. I only have so many things. Hmm. <laughs> I'm filled with fear. I only- stop shaking at me. Well? I'm also kind of- I feel a bit better now that I don't have to leave <laughs> the area anymore. Like, that's really nice. I don't have to be concerned about that anymore. Alright, we need to put down the beans in particular. Those need to have a spot. Alright, let's put them here. Stop. <laughs> Can I put that down? Oh, I can't. Okay, you're gonna have to go. I'm sorry. If only you were smaller, I could have just taken the seed. Oh well. We go by three by threes. So, all of you need to get out of the way. Oh, missed. I need one more. Bonk. All right water everything. So I don't know if I'm gonna have enough seeds, but I'm hoping I will. We'll see. <laughs> Eventually I won't, but you know. Deal with that when we have to. I do feel slightly more relaxed now that I don't have to worry about it as much. Alright. Parsnips! All parsnip! All parsnip! All the time! And some mixed seeds. Alright. I think that's a cauliflower and a potato? That's nice. <laughs> Alright, yeah. We can just... I'm gonna put this away. I don't need to hold onto this watering can right now. Although it would do me some good to fill it. Let's go down here. The water is down here, right? There's water down here. I think. Somewhere. Yeah, water. This is one where you're actually gonna need to put a well up here. Because usually, in the ones that I've played... Like, in the forest one, and I think in the base game one, like, the base map, there's a water source, like, here. But there isn't right now, so. I won't bother putting those away right now. I can just go. I am going to get a field snack. We're gonna pick up the thing. And the onions. We can eat the onions. Do we want to eat the onions? They don't go for much gold anyways. Who cares? I'll just eat them. Spring onion. Monch. Munch. Delicious. Alright. Okay, so, first things first. We're gonna wander around and get rid of all of these. Oh god, what just happened? <laughs> the game just froze. For like a hot second. So yeah, we're gonna want to get all of these taken care of. So that we can hopefully get some mixed seeds. That'll be nice. And it'll help us to explore and see where the fuck everything is. <laughs> because currently, I don't know where anything is. I don't know if there's like a foraging spot. I don't know where the mining spot is. I have no idea where anything is. So, you know, that's unfortunate. But it is what it is. It's hard to see. I'm gonna try not to hit those teeny tiny trees, because I actually want them to grow so that I get more trees.
With our foraging thing, did that say that we could get seeds from trees yet? Or did we have to wait a bit? Until we're able to get seeds from trees. Hmm. I did not look long enough to read that. Is there a way to check? On that? I don't think that there is. Just axe efficiency. Probably not a way to check. Unfortunate. Oh well. I'm gonna leave that long grass, at least in some areas for now. It's good for when you finally are able to get animals, so yeah, in the distant future I will be able to get an animal pen of some kind. <laughs> Just the once. Because I won't be able to like do them very fast around each other. Wait, can you get multiple builds going at once? I don't think so. I'm pretty sure it's only like the one, right? So I would have to just... Oh, wrong one. Yeah, I'm gonna have to like once a season, maybe twice a season because I can go at the beginning, but like no, it really is just once a season because even then it's right at the beginning and the end, so it's still just once every season. I can go and get, like, a building created. And I'm not gonna be able to do it this season. I'll have to wait until summer, if I'm able to get one at all. I'll save up materials and, like, take it with me so that hopefully I can get, like, a coop or something. What is better to get? Like, first stop. I'm thinking a coop. But it might be better to get cow. Is cow better? Or is egg better? That's the real question here. The things we need to know. Oh crap, there was a baby seed. I didn't want to kick that. Kick that fucking words. I speak the English language. Yeah, this music is pretty chill, but like I usually don't listen to it when I'm playing Stardew because it gets me really stressed out after a while. <laughs> I'm just like hearing the same song all over and over again. Forever and ever. That's the way down. Man, I was really close. But that bridge is not crossable at the moment, so. <laughs> that is another thing, is that like, and uh, Kevin mentioned it, in, call me Kevin, in his video. He mentioned one of the issues is that you can't really upgrade your stuff easily if you don't really go into town at all. And if you go into town only once every once in a while, it's still hard because then you won't have that specific tool for at least a season, which is true. And like, especially because I don't think it's even like the next day that you can get it. I think you have to wait a couple of days, which means that even if I go in and I'm allowed to go in for two days straight, I will still have to just leave my tool there for the entire of the season. And I think that it's worth it to do that regardless. There's a lot of worms over here. That's really nice. Yep, a geode. I found it. I can't get it cracked for a while, but I will when I can. Ooh, stuff to bring to what's-his-face at the museum. Fun. Alright, but yeah, so... I think it would still be worth it. I will return for those later. Please move. It's still worth it to go and get your your tool improved, even if it means that you have to spend like an entire season without it. So I will just like pick a time and then spend a season without like a pickaxe. Because I think that should be the first one that I get. Because as much as it would be useful to get an axe, like to get rid of those big rocks, that would be great. It's way more room for like tree growth and other things, so I think getting the pickaxe fixed up first would be fantastic. But yeah, that is something that's just going to have to take a while, you know? Which is a little unfortunate, but it be that way sometimes, you know? I'm just getting rid of these rocks so more other kinds of rocks can pop up in their stead. I don't know if you can get like a bunch of really rare stuff here. Like the, it kind of reminds me, oop, hitting without needing to hit. It reminds me a bit of the, um, I'll just use the stack for now. 
the area that's over in the top right, basically, when you get that, um, the bridge built or whatever near the mine, but like above it to the right. Is it above the mine? It's kind of below the mine, really. But yeah, like, you know what I'm talking about. That area. I got a chicken statue. Yep, I know. I'll come back for that. God, now I've lost it. <laughs> trying to like navigate it's all messy stuff everywhere at least I know where oh fuck there's a stump at least I know where everything is now how did I get in here how did I get out where do I go here <laughs> is it here I mean this is leading somewhere where the fuck am I where is this oh okay this is the way up okay <laughs> lost for a second this is moderately confusing I'm going to hold on to these things because I'm allowed to leave eventually, so I'm just going to keep them. Okay. I don't have any food to be able to do more things today. And it's already 7pm anyways, so it's probably fine to just grab this clay and then end the day. God. Okay. Jesus. Oh my god. <laughs> Do not hold a thing that will cost you any energy. It's nice that you can get a lot of clay out of that, though. Hopefully it'll continue to spawn clay with some regularity. That would be a nice resource to be able to get a lot of. Oh, God. I'm trying to navigate. This is so much stuff. I need to clear out all of these tiny things. Alright. Anyways. So, yeah. That's part of the things that I am planning on doing is... Yeah, I'm gonna have to just be without a pickaxe for, like, a season at some point. I don't know when specifically, but when I have the mats to get a pickaxe improved. I'm going to move. I feel uncomfortable sitting as I am. Which also means I have to move the microphone. Ow, god. Jesus Christ. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Ow. And the lighting is off because I was facing the window, but I'm not going to anymore, so... You're just gonna have to deal with bad lighting. Sorry. <laughs> I'm not willing to set the light up. Mining proficiency's gotten improved, though. I can make cherry bombs. Not that I have any need for them. <laughs> just there. That's cool. And it would be a bit of a waste of resources to make them. In my opinion. Welcome to the thing. <laughs> Clear and sunny. That's cool. <laughs> Good humor. <clears throat> cool. Thanks. I kind of prefer when it rains. Keep finding cool stuff. Backpack is full. Not really. I mean, I guess. Kind of. Nice. Alright. I really need to make the thing. Mm. Not those. Where is the... Wait. I haven't fully explored everywhere. Where is the grandfather's fucking... Jesus Christ. Not the grandfather. Not the grandfather's fucking. That's not what I'm looking for. It's over there the shrine or whatever to the grandfather. The sky whales are crying. Let me in. Okay. Wait for my return on the dawn of your third year. Okay. Burp. Man, this does bring to question, though. Like, are there any forageables in this area? Like, it would have been really profitable and helpful if I could have been able to get a daffodil. So that I could get the forageable seeds, you know? But I don't know if you can get those here. I don't know if that's a thing that'll pop up somewhere. Like, usually the grassy areas will sometimes have forageables, but I don't know. I don't know if any are gonna really appear. Hmm. Sag. Alright, well, I'm gonna mine all of this. Might as well.
I like how even though you're just staying at home and like, wow, not even going out and doing all of the other exciting stuff, you still have a lot to do. At least so far. Like, I'll probably have less to do over time, but... At the moment, I still have a lot of things that I just need to do in order to sort some stuff out. Alright, I'm gonna go around. Ack! I didn't mean to hit that. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna clear out the place of all of the teeny tiny logs. Because we don't want them here. We don't want you here. You're not welcome. Go away. Nothing exciting is happening. Boop. Oh. I'm sitting in a position where I'm going to start slouching again. I need to try not to do that. Sorry, I'm moving the mic. I'm going to have to deal with that sound. I apologize. Okay. I'm trying to relax without slouching too much, because that eventually starts to hurt my shoulders, and it's just not good for me. Like... I feel like it's because I'm just not sitting in like a normal position that I would sit in. But I feel like this isn't super far away from like how I would sit normally anyways. So I'm not sure why that's happening. I just start to slouch a lot. Warp. I will get the rocks eventually. Well, I have to get these rocks at least so that I can get down faster. There's a bit of wood there. Bonk. No. I have to get used to the controls again. This always happens whenever I like switch games. It takes a second for me to get readjusted to using the controls for each individual game. Oh, I got a geode at some point. That's nice. Nope, hit that. Right, stuck. <laughs> That's really annoying. Those are just blocking some of the bridges. I like how there's just this little, like, plateau area with, like, nothing on it, really. It's just here. <laughs> like, what would I put here? I could put, like, plants. A shed, maybe? I don't know. Maybe that's where I'll put all of my barrels. Ah. Hit. Do not hit tree stump. That is not necessary. Like how now we're just sitting here in silence. Ugh. Sorry for sniffling. I don't have a cold. I'm just very phlegmy all of the time. I'm sorry. <laughs> Ugh. I feel like I always have to apologize for that. Bonk. I found the shrine today, right? I think so. I'm literally already losing track of things. <laughs> Starting to do it again. Why does that happen? Why am I doing that? Stop. Running out of energy. Not much to do about that because I already ate all of the food that I really had. What is like, okay, what am I willing to sell and what am I not? Like, of the things that I have, I don't think there's anything in particular I really want to sell, you know? Like, maybe the cockle, because, like, I don't really need this. I don't need it for anything. It's just here. And, like, I don't want to sell those if I can help it. I want to hold on to them so that I can eventually give them to the dude. And I don't really want to sell these yet because I want to at least have enough to make, like, the seeds once I can eventually go and get some more stuff for it. Hmm. 
And like some of these things are actually good for like constructing things. So I don't really want to sell those either. Hmm. Sorry. Oh god. Man, it really sucks that I don't have any dandelions. It's really annoying. I'm just gonna sell this. Not that. This. I don't need a cockle. Well, I can use a little bit more and get some rocks. Just to use up my energy fully. I'll be fully out at this one. Okay, now I'm at zero. That's all I can get for the day. I'm out of energy now. I'll just toss these in here. And then I'll go to bed. I guess. <laughs> Not much to be done about that. Alright. Let me sleep. That's that. We got some money though, so that's cool. <laughs> <clears throat> We're gonna need some money by the time we get to the egg festival, because that's when strawberries are available, and we want to get strawberries. So. <laughs> Whose rooster is that? Good humor. Cool. Spring onions in that one space that you cannot go to. Cool. Oop. Hey, Clint. I hadn't even met you yet. Yeah. Get most of the thing. Ooh. Wait, is that the blueprints for the furnace? Yes. Thanks. Metal bars. Cool. Thanks, Clint. For having me upgrade one of your tools. Heading home. Take it easy. Goodbye. Cool. Do I have the resources to make one yet? 25 stone, 20 copper ore. I do not. Oh, I do. That's cool. I can go ahead and make one. 69. That's cool. <laughs> All right. Let's put this over here. Bonk. Okay. Yes, I know. I will when I have enough copper. But I don't right now, so later. Okay. Now we gotta water the crops. Gonna take a lot of energy, which is annoying. Crows! Oh god, I have to go get my mixed seeds. Mmm. Crows! Why? Why are you doing this to me? I really need to be able to make a scarecrow. Because I really don't want to have to lose any of my seeds to crows. That's really unfortunate. I really need to not lose my seeds to crows. That makes me really sad, actually. <laughs> At least they didn't eat one of my bean seeds. That would have made me really sad. Those are really expensive. They were hard to get. <laughs> but I did spend money on that parsnip seed. That's like $20 right down the drain because a crow ate the seed. Please don't eat my seeds. I only have so many. <laughs> Please, crow. Okay. The water is pretty far away, which is moderately irritating. <laughs> but whatever. It's fine. Maybe I could put, like, a coop there or something. I'm not really sure. The map kind of shows the layout, actually, of where things are on the farm. There's this little plateau where the stones are is over there. And then like the bridges and where things are and stuff. Vaguely. It's like close enough. So yeah, I could put one there. And then maybe like the barn over there or something? Or down there? Hmm. Thoughts. Not sure where to put things. There's not really room for a barn down here. So it would have to be somewhere over there. Mm. Well, let's go see if there's anything in the place. Right, that's a rock. <laughs> and then once we've checked over here to see if there's anything here, then we'll wander around and get rid of some rocks. Just a big rock. It's just a boulder. I don't know if it like ups the chance of something good popping up if I wait and like leave things there. 
I feel like probably not. I don't think it matters. So, I'm just gonna hit whatever pops up when it pops up. I don't know. Oh, that was the ground. Now that I've stopped talking, it's silent. <laughs> Gee, thanks, game. Man, I keep missing. I'm not just hitting the floor. It's really unfortunate. Right, there's a rock there. I keep walking towards that bridge and then remembering, right, there's a rock. I really need to get my pickaxe upgraded. So that I don't have to deal with it. I also need to get my axe upgraded so I don't have to deal with those. But I keep wanting to use that one specifically, so I feel like that'll be something that'll do me some good. <clears throat> oh man, I think a stone just fell into the water. That's really sad. Man, I can't believe I have to wait until, like, fully the end of the month to be able to get a fishing rod. That's really unfortunate. I guess it's not like as bad as the full on challenge that Kevin's doing. Where it's like, can't even leave and go and do anything for a full year. It's like a lot. <laughs> That's why I'm not doing the exact same challenge. I'm doing my version of it because it's a bit easier on me. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna wander around and see if there's any forageables that are over here by like the old man's place. Anything over here? Ooh, there's a thing in the ground. That'll make me slow, but I don't think it really matters if I'm a bit slow. That'll be fine. I'm not gonna pass out. I'll just get really slow. Right? Ah, yep. <laughs> it was just rocks. That's really annoying. <laughs> well. Now we just have to slowly walk back home. Whatever. Should always get the worm spots just in case. You never know when there might be something valuable there. But still. <laughs> wow, really slow. <laughs> it's lonely without a cat. Well, we got a lot of rocks today. That's nice. <laughs> it's 2pm. I'm going to go ahead and go to bed because there's nothing else to do. <laughs> there's nothing else to keep myself occupied with. So I will sleep. Yes. Okay. <laughs> it's interesting. Not being able to leave. <laughs> Sunny day, unfortunate. What's happening? Spirits are very happy today. That's nice. Fuck you! Fuck off, crow! You bitch! <sighs> so annoying. That's two parsnips lost. Ugh! Yeah, thanks. The Jojo Mart stuff. Yep, go by Jojo Mart. Not gonna do that. Thanks for the offer. Man, my seeds! Crows! At least they didn't get the cauliflower or the beans, but they were really close to the beans. And still, this is so many parsnips, and like, I only have so many. I only have so many seeds. Stop! <laughs> Please, I beg. 
All oh, right, you have less energy when you're exhausted. Okay, well, more reason to not get exhausted, I guess. <clears throat> Go down and fill this. At least the area is a lot more clear now. Other than like the trees and all of these stumps and boulders. Man. You're making me lose seeds. Do you know how much these are costed me? Ugh. That's 40 gold down the drain. I was almost done with the rocks. Let's go finish hitting all of the small rocks. Or at least get more progress on getting all the small rocks. Oh man, there's a log. I noticed the coal. I'm going to go get it. Bonk. Ugh. You know what? Since it's dark anyways, it's not like it matters. No, not there. Go here. What I'm going to do... that work? <laughs> Did it do what I wanted it to do? It should have done. Yep, cool. <clears throat> All right, <laughs> back to it. Yeah, I just got rid of my video. I don't, I don't really care about you seeing me, but it's dark anyways. Like, you can't see me super great. And I'm not like doing anything exciting. I'm just kind of chilling. Yeah, this is a, a chill stream. We're just getting things in Stardew, you know? Stuck on the farm forever. We aren't allowed to leave. Just gotta stay here. Can do a few more things. Two more. Three more. Three more. Bonk. Bonk. Ooh. I don't want to risk it. I don't want to be exhausted again, because then that costs me energy the next day, and that's not very nice when I only have so many things that I'm able to do. <laughs> I have to use the energy very carefully. So, I guess that'll be the end of this day. Because I can't really do anything else, and I'm not willing to eat any of the things that I have in my inventory, so we're just going to go to sleep. Is it raining tomorrow? Or is it sunny again? It's sunny again, isn't it? Ugh. Upsetting. Ugh, the sunlight. Well, <laughs> I'm going to bed at 10 a.m. Ooh, mining level two. Fun. <laughs> Alright. Swear to god if there are any crows. They didn't. Oh yes. Parsnips. 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 Lots of parsnips. All of the parsnips. All of the parsnips. Yes. 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 I'm working on it. Build a coop. I will one day. Thanks for the gold that I can't do anything with for a while. Okay. Nice. I only got one starred one, which is really unfortunate. Alright. Oh man. How many- okay. Do I remember? I'm gonna keep ten of these parsnips. <clears throat> Actually, I'm gonna keep eleven. And then I'm going to sell the rest. So, and reason being is that, like, I know that I need, like, a certain amount for the thing. Like, the- the community center or whatever, but I don't remember specifically how much. So I'm just going to, you know, <laughs> hold on to 11 of them because I also know that I need to give one to somebody at some point. Pam, maybe? Someone needs a parsnip, like, at some point later. So, man, that big chunk of stuff is now empty <laughs> and I can't replace any of the seed spots. <laughs> 
That was all of the mixed seeds that I was able to get from foraging. It's really unfortunate. Oh, sorry about that sound of me breaking my neck. <clears throat> but sometimes you gotta. Man. Really wish I already had a fishing rod. It's really unfortunate that I couldn't get one on the first day and I just have to wait until Lily is willing to give me one at the end of the month. It's very unfortunate. Alright, is there anything down here? Right, there's a stump in the way. It's really annoying. Very much not super happy about that stump being in the front of my bridge. Okay, I think we've gotten all of like the little logs and the bits of rock that are around. So now, our mining will only come from this little spot, and anything that pops up, or any new rocks that show up eventually. Bonk. At least that is getting me more clay. That's really cool. I appreciate that that's a thing that just happens. Alright, well now, our time can be spent chopping trees, I guess. <laughs> It's just what's gonna happen from now on. Ooh! I think we can smelt this copper into a bar now. We have like five. Hang on. And I already have a coal in my inventory. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Bonk. Yeah, we can get a copper bar. Won't be able to use it for anything yet, but we'll have one. It's actually a possibly decent resource to sell later on if we start really getting stuff from over there, but I doubt that it'll generate enough copper for us to be able to really like use the copper as an income kind of source. I feel like that's not gonna work out, you know? Thing. Oh yeah, I just realized belatedly that I was blocking like the the corner and the stuff that was happening there. Something to keep in mind for the future if I decide to put my face back on there. But whatever. Anyways. Is that gonna fall? No. Kind of? It kind of fell. Well, I have to go get down there and retrieve it. Give me a sec. Just gonna grab this first. Man, you know it'll be a really good resource to get one day? <laughs> the seed maker. That'll be nice. So you can just regen all of your seeds. That'll be a really pleasant thing to get. Bonk. Can I get another tree? With the amount of energy I have left? Probably? At least just, like, one. <gasps> I missed! Wasted. Okay. <laughs> just enough. Alright, cool. Now we're going to the scythe, just in case I click the button on accident. Alright, a decent amount of wood. That's nice. And I did get the seeds, which is cool. I am able to get seeds immediately, right off the bat. That's nice. I'm not going to turn them into things. I'm going to plant them again. Let's go over here. And we'll plant these seeds. Bonk, bonk. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Okay. More trees! We're gonna have to really get into replanting all the tree seeds when we get them. Alright, well, <laughs> now we sleep. Alright. Let's see how much money we made with those parsnips. Yes, farming level one. I can get the scarecrow so I can protect my beans. Okay. I hope nothing ate them while I was sleeping. Over 600, that's nice. Okay. Now, we just have to hope that our beans are safe. 
Our beans are like the biggest thing to keep safe, you know? Okay, weather report. Sunny. Again. Fortune teller. What? Good humor. The queen of sauce. A recipe for stir fry. I don't care. Not all of the flavor text. Thanks. Okay, nothing is eating my plants. But we need to make the scarecrow immediately. What do we need for the scarecrow? Wood, coal, fiber. Okay. Wood. Coal. Fiber. Watering can. Scarecrow. Bulk. Thanks. How far does the scarecrow go? Eight tiles. So. It's one, two, three, four, five, six. So if we put him... Well, we can just put him here. Can't we? Or I can put him here. But I like having him here. That'll be fine. Now my plants are safe. <laughs> That's really reassuring, genuinely, though. It felt like I was living on the edge before. <laughs> was not super happy about it. Alright. Oh, the thing is done smelting. I have an ingot. <laughs> I have a bar. What one is the thing? What? It's gone. It just leaves. You don't give me anything for it. Unfortunate. Alright, anyways. Trees! <clears throat> I'll go look at the rock thing, like, later. I'm gonna leave it alone for now. Because it'll just make rocks on its own, you know? On the bright side, we do have a decent amount of gold, so when the egg festival thing happens, we will be able to get some strawberry seeds, which will be fun. I'm looking forward to that. You know, a part of me likes not having to leave. Like, the absolute introvert that I genuinely am. I am enjoying the fact that I don't have to deal with people and, like, wandering around and, like, stressfully wandering about the town to try and finish various tasks. I'm happy about that. I like that that's a thing I don't have to be concerned about. But another part of me is weirdly stressed about it because I know that there are days coming where I have to go. I'm, like, not stressed about being here forever. I'm stressed about having to go back. You know? Like, that's the thing that stresses me out. Is just the fact that I have to, uh, at some point, I have to return to the city and, like, deal with people. Like, it's not the being away from everybody that's stressing me out. It's the fact that one day I'll have to go back. <laughs> like, that's the thing that stresses me. I feel like that's pretty accurate for real life. Maybe... <laughs> Maybe I liked the idea of this challenge because I related to it a little too hard. Just living on a teeny tiny farm all by myself, away from humanity, you know? It's not super far away from how I live my life IRL, so... <laughs> not that my dad's giant ass garden is really, like, a farm, but it's pretty fucking close, honestly. <laughs> yeah, my dad is a YouTuber. Known as Jim Bob's Garden, and he does gardening YouTube stuff. If you ever want to go check that out out of boredom, it's pretty fun if you're into gardening stuff. And he just talks about, you know, having a, a big ass garden. It's gonna be a food forest one day, so he says. It's pretty neat. But yeah, that's where I live. So it's not super far away from what we're doing in this game. <laughs> not even super far away that I'm going to bed at like 10 a.m. <laughs> Alright. Weather. Is it gonna rain? Yeah. Raining. Yes. Somewhat annoyed. Not that that really affects me. Fences. I don't really need them. I don't care. <gasps> potato? Potato! I got a potato. I'm gonna hold on to this potato. 
These potatoes are hard to make, so I'm just gonna hold on to this. I will sell my parsnip. Bonk. Okay. Bonk. Water. I need to drink water. I guess I don't even really need to pause it. I can just leave it going. Because I have all the time in the world. Because I don't really have anything else to do during the day. Sorry for that squeak. Sorry. I'm just drinking water, I swear. Oh, fuck. Water twice. Did not mean to do that. Am I gonna run out? Aw, oh, I suck. Alright. I really like this hairstyle. It's really cute. <laughs> I like how fluffy it looks. Oh, wrong way. Man, sad. A sad garden site. One day we'll be able to remake our seeds. <laughs> One day we'll be able to go and get some more seeds. In the distant future, but not today. really worried something was going to fall into the water. Like, I do not have <laughs> the resources to spare to just let things fall into the river. <laughs> Slouching again. Stop that. I was trying to like, I'm just talking now idly while I chop down trees because that's all that I am able to do at the moment, but I was trying to do like work stuff, like I was trying to do some voice acting auditions today, and then I like, I'm not doing super hot today, so I was listening back to the audition reel that I had made and I was like, oh my god, I cannot handle listening to my own voice and the way that it sounds every time I take a breath in between like lines and some of the lines were so bad and I was like, I kind of want to redo some of these but also they were sounding really good but I did something stupid with the mic or I made a weird sound or I was a little too loud and I was like, man, so many teeny tiny mistakes and it just sounds terrible and it's making me upset, so... A part of me was tempted to just send the audition as it was anyways and be like, just get have the confidence to just send it anyways and be like, I can make sure it doesn't do that later or something like that in the notes, but then I was like, do you really have the confidence to do that? And I was like, no. <laughs> so I did not send it. <laughs> and I'm like quietly disappointed about it, but also I'm like, man, I wanted to really do quality work, you know? I wanted to do a good job and it just was not good enough. And like, it makes me wonder, is it ever going to be good enough? Will I ever be okay with it and how it sounds? Probably not. And that makes me a little bit sad. <laughs> I don't know. Sometimes my anxiety is a little too high for me to be able to do anything. <sighs> it's just how life is, you know? Sometimes you get anxious and you can't do anything. At least it's how it is for me. I don't know about other people. Maybe other people don't have to deal with that kind of anxiety like I do. I'm sure there are tons of people who do, but like... Maybe it's not normal. It's not like an average thing for everybody to suffer through that much anxiety about literally everything in their life, but that's just how I live my life, I guess. sleeping with my head on the headboard. Foraging, level two, nice.
Day 9 of spring. Man, the season really goes by fast when you're just rushing through every day like this. Oh, it's raining. It's gonna be sunny. Displeased. Unfortunate. What's in the mailbox? Apologize. Thanks, Robin. Right, I don't need to pick that up. Let's go. There's a parsnip. You know, I'm waiting for my beans to be ready. I'm really waiting for them. I'm excited for beans. One day there will be beans, but not today. Well, back to chopping trees. <laughs> I have nothing else to do. It's a little sad. <clears throat> I wonder if this is like kind of one of those things that turns into a presentable liberty sort of situation, you know? Where like you just quietly go insane because you're left all alone forever with like barely anything to do. Like, they also have that in The Sims and stuff, the like stir crazy a thing, and I don't think that it happens in The Sims 4. I'm pretty sure in The Sims 4 it's just a thing of like, you're lonely and sad, so go talk to somebody. But I know for a fact that in The Sims 3, you could get the stir crazy emotion eventually. Or like the stir crazy effect, which would just make you like really uncomfortable for a while. If you just stayed in your house for too long, then that's what would happen. And like... I don't know, that doesn't really happen to me. Like, I... When was the last time I left my house? Like, legitimately, I'm like trying to think. Man, actually, I can't even remember. When was the last time I left my house? Was it when I went to go help my sister move? Was that the last time I went out of the house? Maybe? I thought something had happened between then and now. That was like four or five weeks ago? I don't know. Like, I don't know, even when we were allowed to leave, like, allowed to leave, even though with everything that was still like going on with all of the, the whole, you know, lockdown thing. I still didn't really leave the house a lot, even when we were allowed to. And they were like, you're allowed to go outside, and I was like, who gives a fuck? I don't leave anyways, and I just stayed home. <laughs> I only left when I really, like, had to. And that was usually for, like, family things, like, events and stuff, I guess. And then I was always, like, trying my best to stay as far away from everybody as possible. Except for, like, my close family, and that was only because, like, we're the only ones... Like, we, we hang out anyway, so it's not like it matters. I think if I leave it for a while, it'll make more things better. You know? Maybe I'm wrong. I might be wrong. I don't know. It's hard to say. More seeds. I don't think it matters how far apart these are. So I'm just gonna put them all down. It's gonna have a huge chunk of seeds all over there. Well, that's that. <laughs> There's nothing else to do. <laughs> but yeah, so, I don't know. I can relate to the whole idea of just never leaving ever, staying in your little house. You know? Pretty content way to live life, at least in my experience. I never really get stir crazy. It's fun to leave every once in a while, go out and like do things, usually just to like chill out with my family, but I don't know. 
It's not really necessary. I'm pretty content as is. When will my beans grow? I want them to be grown. Please grow, beans. Alright, water. Soon I'm only going to have to water three things. <laughs> That's really sad. Okay. Well, more trees. Let's go chop down the rest of the trees that are around. There's not le much left, but, you know. Oh, this one's really risky. I'm a little bit intimidated. Please don't fall to the right. Okay, good. Thank you. Oh, there's stuff down there. Is that new? Or did I just forget to take care of that? No, I think it's new. I think it just popped up. That's what I'm going to assume happened. I could be wrong. Ooh, a chicken statue again. I can sell that chicken statue! Because I have one already. Man, it is genuinely very unfortunate that, like, you can't do any of the foraging seeds. Can you grow the foraging seeds, like, out of their specific seasons? I feel like you can just do them whenever. You know? But I'm not absolutely certain, and that makes me nervous. <laughs> I might have to look that up. Just to, like, clarify. Because if I'm lucky, and on the last day of spring I find um, a dandelion, then, if I can grow them in different seasons, and they don't have a specific seasonal requirement, then I can just grow the foraging seeds throughout summer. Which would be really cool, but I don't know if that's a thing that I can do, so... Who's to say? <laughs> I don't want to risk wasting seeds if I can't do that, so instead of experimenting with it, I will look it up when it, the need <laughs> arises. I don't even know if I'm even going to find a dandelion before this the whole season ends. Oh, please go that way. Oh wait, I don't know if I have enough. Maybe I can at least bring the tree down. I had enough to make the tree fall, at least. And it fell to the right, which is good. I don't think it matters. I think I can probably just do those every day, and every once in a while it'll have a nice haul in it. The rest of the time it'll just be boulders. It's just how it's gonna go, I guess. Sorry, I'm like cracking my knuckles behind the microphone. I need to stop doing stuff like that. Worst. Here, I have a chicken statue. I'm going to plant these pine cones. One of the trees is getting taller. That's nice. I look like I'm trying to spell something out, but doing a really bad job of it. <laughs> oh. That's that. Nice. Yeah, 50 for that chicken statue. That's good. Now it's the 11th. <laughs> Weather. It's gonna be sunny. I always check this and I'm not sure why. What do you have to say for me? Crows? Yep, crows suck. I agree. What's in the mail? Lost your axe. I'll find it one day. <laughs> In the distant future. I feel like at this point I can probably just carry the watering can on me. 
there's not a lot of stuff to collect. Ooh, there's a tree. Man, I'm up to a thousand gold. That's nice. That's in a really inconvenient spot. Okay. Ooh, tree. I feel like I'm so used to trying to be fast when I'm like going around and doing things in Stardew so that I can like rush through and obtain as many things while I'm wandering around as possible that now that I can't go anywhere like I feel like I'm going too fast and that irritates me like <laughs> <coughs> like I feel like I should go slower so that I'm like not finishing as many tasks with as much speed so that I have more time to just do things because otherwise I just have to end the day and I feel like I didn't do enough because like I just didn't have the energy but I had enough time that's why it's like I'm moderately conflicted about how this is going <laughs> I need to like relax <laughs> and chill out and not run around quite as much oh man some fell in all right, what's up here? What's up here? Just more boulders. It's really unfortunate. Oh, it gave me a coal. That's nice. I'm running out of trees to chop. <laughs> Are those the last of the trees? Might have been. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know if I have any more trees that I can chop down. Am I out of things to do? It really sucks that I wasn't able to get the fishing rod. I would really like to be able to fish. That would be really helpful right now. Then I have energy, but nothing to do with it. Mm. <laughs> really unfortunate. I guess I could go around just hoeing the floor and see where that gets me. I could do that. Sure. Sure, let's do that. Why not? <laughs> you can find things in the ground. We can at least get, like, a ton of clay. And if we're lucky, maybe we'll find some other things. Okay. Let's just go hoe the floor. <laughs> we have nothing else to do. No. Go. Where is the first spot to hoe? Here. Yep, clay. We're just gonna get a lot of clay. That's what we're gonna do today. See, this is what I'm talking about. It's like, because I was, like, being too efficient. Because I was being too efficient with what I was doing. Now, I have energy but nothing to do. Whereas before, I had enough to do and not enough energy for it. So now it's just switched over. Okay. So now I'm forced to just hoe the ground <laughs> and see what I find. Well, I got three clay, so that's nice. And now I have nothing else to do, so let's go to bed. <laughs> All right. Okay. Clear and sunny. Perfect weather for the egg festival. Woo! We can actually leave. <laughs> the event will take place in Pelican Town. Starting from 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. Don't be late. Cool. Fortune teller. Displeased. Unfortunate. Oh! The cat! Hi, Marnie. Hello. See this cat? I do! Hello. I found it sitting outside the entrance to your farm. I think it's a stray, poor little thing. Hello. I think it likes this place. Hey, um, don't you think this farm could use a good cat? Yes. I love just the name Miso. I'm going to leave it as Miso, because I like that name. It's cute. You'd be a good kitty now. I love. 
I always name the cat Miso. I used to name it other things, but like I feel like it's more fun when I name it Miso. It's just very cute and it suits the cat. Okay. I got a potato and the beans are ready. Beans! I got two potatoes this time. Nice. Potato and a bean. And then we put these beans in here. Bonk. Yeah, the beans! My beans are growing. I'm excited. <laughs> this is good news. Good news. There's water in the cat bowl already. Good. Well, um, <clears throat> we can just go around, look for trees that have grown, pet shop, and then go check in the stone area to see if there's any rocks. <laughs> I wonder where the cat is. This is a really big winding area. I'm not sure where it ended up. <laughs> it's somewhere. I'm not gonna worry about it. I'm leaving that tall grass, by the way, because it will be useful one day when I eventually get animals. So, right now it's not, but one day it'll be useful. So I'll just let it grow on its own. Ooh, there's stuff here today! More than just boulders! Yeah, copper ore! Not enough for a bar just yet, but we're getting there. Geodes! Yeah. Alright. Exciting news. No grown cheese over here, so go look over by the shrine. Are there any grown trees? Probably not. But we're gonna look anyways. That'll be grown soon. Alright, but it's not yet, so <laughs> just leave that alone. Any trees? No? Alright. I've gotten stuck. I should probably leave some down here just to like... Leave things on the floor, you know? That sounded weird. You know what I mean. Probably. Partially. Almost. <laughs> sort of. Alright, anyways. Ah, oh, yeah, festival is tomorrow. Do I want to, like, sell some things because the egg festival is tomorrow? <clears throat> I could sell some sap. Hmm. Does basic fertilizer go for more than sap? You would think that it would. You know? Okay, I'm gonna look up a couple of things. Now is the time that I'm going to search in the search bar for some things. Okay, so Stardew Valley. Um, basic fertilizer. Okay, I want to know the price. Show me the price. It's only 2G, so actually it's worse than just sap. Okay, cool. So, if we're going to sell some stuff, we could probably sell some sap. But also, I want to know... Stardew Valley, um... Uh, what are they? Wild Seeds. Alright, show me the Wild Seeds. Yeah, so I think you can only grow them in their season.
Yeah, that's unfortunate. I think the seasonal seeds do have to actually be grown in their season. Man, that sucks. It's really annoying. <laughs> well, now I know. Okay, so. Do we want to sell sap? We have a lot of sap. Um, we'll just split it off. And leave like a hundred sap in here. Just to make sure that we have some. You know? Because it's good to have various resources. And now, I'm just gonna hold the floor some more because there's nothing else to do <laughs> so you know why not hold the floor Bonk. and see if that gives you something I'm gonna be this unlucky during the summer one because like man if I had just gotten a dandelion I could have tried to grow those Ooh, clay but man I got everything but a dandelion I got a ton of daffodils even but no dandelions really unfortunate I'm getting a lot of clay this time that's nice well a lot I got three pieces <laughs> still it feels like a lot Ooh, four. There we go. Well, six clay pieces. That's nice. Just very slowly but steadily getting some more clay. Cool. Alright. There you are. Mmm, so cute. Okay, now we sleep. Tomorrow we can leave the house. Woo! <laughs> Ow. God. My spine. Okay. At least I think it's today. Did I miss it? Was I disoriented? It should be today. I think it's today. The Egg Festival should be today. Yeah. I think. It says. It's festival day. It's time for the festival. It's happening today. Hello, Miso. It's happening today. It's festival day. We can leave the house. <laughs> Tree's not grown. That's unfortunate. <laughs> I don't think there's gonna be any trees. Probably not. None of the saplings look like they've gotten that far. Nope. Yeah, I don't think we have any trees. Not today. Unfortunate. But, oh well. <laughs> Not much to be done about that. I am very excited for when I can eventually get the fishing rod. I'll at least have more things to do when I get it. So, that'll be cool. Oh, we got some geodes today. That's cool. Very nice. And that's that. <laughs> Nothing else to do, so I guess I can hoe the floor some more. <laughs> Just do that until we have to leave. Already got some clay. Look at me. On festival days, by the way, like I know I say that I will allow myself to leave the house just in general on festivals, but like, I'm only allowed to go and attend the festival. Like, I'm not allowed to go and do other things, because that would feel- that feels a little like cheating. So I am only allowed to go and join in on the egg festival. 
Woo. I'm not allowed to go and do other things. I'm just going to go to the festival. So I can go and buy things at the festival and attend the festival and get that reward. Because I'm great at finding eggs, usually. So yeah, I will allow myself to attend the festivities when they happen each time, but I'm not allowed to go out and do other things. It'd be nice if I could, but, you know. I can't, so it is what it is. Right. That's enough. Bonk. Got five clay. That's nice. Alright. Um, just in case. Put that there. Alright. Oh, I guess... Yeah, I... I think this will be fine. I'll get the stuff that's here. Oh, I should chop these trees down. Oh, I should have saved my energy. I got a dandelion! And there's a leak. I should have remembered to do that. Aw, oh, man. This is like the one area where I'm allowed to actually go and interact with things, I think. Before I have to go to the festival area. Man. I should have done. I wasted my energy on other things. Ah, oh, they suck. Can I chop down one tree? Do I have enough for one tree? I can probably get one tree. Let's get one tree. Okay. I'll get a tree. Yeah, tree seed. Well, we can grow the spring seeds now that we've gotten a singular dandelion. <clears throat> so that's nice. We have two dandelions. Bro. Hello. What's in the shop? We really just want strawberry seeds. <laughs> like, as tempting as it is. Oh man, I think that that's new. Um, as tempting as it is to get some of these extra things. Particularly the, long, the lawn flamingo. But I need seeds. So we're just going to get a ton of strawberry seeds. As many as we can afford. 16 strawberry seeds. And we can use this as an opportunity to greet everybody. I'm not going to read what they say because I don't care. But I am going to talk to everybody so that I can just get it out of the way. Hey! Although I don't know if it really counts it as the thing. By me doing this. I'm not sure. Who am I missing? I'm just gonna find the people I'm missing and talk to them and see if maybe it'll count when I get to it eventually. I'm not sure if it will. Can I do trash cans while I'm here? No. Sag. Hey. I don't care. I'm just greeting you so that I can get everything out of the way. <coughs> Man, why can't you do trash cans on holidays? That's unfortunate. It's like one of the few days when I'm allowed to leave. Man. Sag. Oh, it worked! <laughs> cool. Hey, guy. Okay. Hey, Lewis. Yeah, let's start. Just get it over with, because I've already purchased what I need to purchase, done the things I needed to do. So, just gotta do the egg hunting part. Yep, yep, yep. Go, 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 go. Just have to swiftly get as many eggs as possible. Egg. Get out of my way, child. Fuck off. Guess one that was an egg. Whack.
I wonder what's like the absolute most amount of eggs that one can obtain. Like if you tried to be super efficient about it. Yep, good. I deserve it. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, I have a hat. <laughs> Does the hat look good with this hair? I'm going to plant the seeds now because I want them to get going already. Does the hat look good? I can't tell if it's dark. I might not wear the hat if it doesn't look as good as I would prefer. Oh, I don't know if I have the energy. I don't. Oh, I don't want to have to put them down. I don't want them. I'll have to do it tomorrow. Shoot. Unfortunate. Hey. Okay. Sleep. Okay. Fine. Ooh, axe proficiency. I got the tapper. That's nice. It'll take me a while to make one, but, you know, we'll get there eventually. Just gotta save up my copper bars. It'll be sunny. Spirits are in good humor. Humor. Coleslaw. Cool. Hey, cat. Bye. Okay. Now is the time. Perfect. Even less energy to get everything set, sorted out. Okay. Strawberry seeds. Okay. Cool. And I got a cauliflower. Nice. And I think there's a second one growing. So that's cool. How does that look in the light? Mm. Not as fun as the floof hair. I like the floof hair more. Okay. Now. We have enough that we can make the thing. We made as much as we could. Get in there. Hopefully it'll give us a good mix of the various forageables, you know? Okay. Now we have four extra. We'll plant them when everything is done growing. Well, no, I can just hold on to this. I can't leave again. I'm stuck here now. <laughs> give someone a gift! No. <laughs> I will one day, but I'm not going to do that right now. A tree has grown! Should I cut this down? I'm tempted to leave it for a bit. Mm. Just so that it grows seeds, drops seeds, or I can just chop it down. I'll just chop it down. Fuck it. It's fine. Will it drop any? It did! Nice. At least one. Always want to get a tree back from the tree that you spend. That's nice. Nothing here. <laughs> All of this is watered now. Grown tree! And an acorn. Nice. A gnat. <sighs> Fuck off. Another tree.
Hmm. Just clay and rocks. But we got some copper. So we can do another copper bar, which is pretty cool. Much excitement. But that is all we can do for the day, which is really unfortunate. So we still have a lot of energy left and nothing to do with it. Bonk, bonk. Boop. Nice. It takes three, doesn't it? No, only two. <gasps> Ooh. We can start doing that. That's exciting. Do we want to, like, set up a spot? Wait. Okay, hang on. So, which one do we want to do first is the real question. And then I think we want to put a spot, a specific place for, like... I'll do acorn, because I have this one here. It was in a weird spot anyways. Okay, so. Bar. Wood. Tapper. Okay. Oop. Now. I'm thinking we want, like, a specific place where we do, like, the tapped trees. You know? Instead of just in this area where we, like, really chop down all of the trees. Maybe, like, here. Or here. I could put them around here. Yeah. Okay. That'll probably work. I'll put them here. So. In. This corner. And when that grows. We'll put a tapper on it. Right now. We can't put it anywhere. So it'll just sit there. But soon. Do I want to get more clay? I could try and get more clay. Let's go hit the ground. Man, it'll be really nice when I eventually am able to just fish instead of just use all my energy by smacking the ground. <laughs> okay. Well, we only got two this time. That's alright. It's not always a very profitable thing to do, just smacking the ground with a hoe, but sometimes, sometimes it is. Hey, cat. All right. It's gonna be sunny. Happy today. Cool. Sandberry season. Yeah. Just getting started. Those crops only grow in one season. Yep. Berries. Yes. Good. Excellent. My beans. They've grown. None up here. Other seasons, then. Cool. That's fine. sell these beans. 
going to tell you that right now. I stand by the ideal of having at least 10 of every single kind of crop. Just in case, you know? So. But only of like the base ones. Although, if I were able to get golden parsnips, then I would have, because those are needed for a thing at the community center later, but I can't, so. Oh well. <laughs> it just is what it is. Okay. Now I'm gonna fill this up again, that way it'll just be full tomorrow. I won't have to fill it up as frequently. At least I won't have to fill it up in between. That's kind of annoying. <laughs> it irritates me on a really base level, so. I might just waste energy now. Bonk. Wait, why did I put that away? Come back. I have no reason to put you away. I could just hold on to you. <laughs> I have the inventory space. There's no reason to worry about space when I'm not really picking up anything. Okay. Is there anything to mine? You said it was gonna be a lucky day, man. It was a lie. Spirits, like, the Welbeck's Oracle thing really does not do anything. <laughs> if it does, it is hard to notice. Alright, well, I'm just going to assume that there's nothing to do. I'm going to go to bed. <laughs> Actually, I should look around to see if there are any other spots where I can get some berries. Because I know that there's those two. There's some other bushes here. And they might have something on other seasons. Nothing here. There's another bush there. Which again, might have something in a different season. Are there any bushes up here? Yeah! Yeah, now we just need to make sure that we know where any salmon berry places are going to be so that we can get the berries. And then up in this area, that bush up there might be for something in a different season though, so that's cool. I don't think there's any other bushes around. I think that was it. Yeah, there's a bush there, but again, it might be for a different season. And there's some there, but they're not reachable, which is unfortunate. Well, we got three, so there's that. Ooh, worms. Yeah, nothing else. That's fine. That is that for the day. I'm not gonna bother hitting the ground today. Feels like a lot. Don't really see a reason to. Sleeping. Ooh, farming level two! I can make a sprinkler. Although I feel like it's probably expensive, so I'm not gonna. <laughs> yep. Not surprising. Clear and sunny. Oh, hit it again. Whoops. I still check every time. Just to see. We got mail. Mm. Thanks, Pierre. <laughs> really helps me out. Going different places. Cool. Alright, well, I know where the bushes are, so. At least we have something to do. 
You're able to just wander around. How do you get that? What? Wait, what? No, don't. What? <laughs> hey. What the fuck? You can't do that to me. Game. <laughs> you can't just put it there and not let me reach it. What a ho! Game. <laughs> That's so mean. <laughs> Why would you do that to me? You can't just put the berries right with, like, right within my grasp. Just out of reach. That's really unfair. That's so aggressive and rude. <laughs> If I could break those fences, I would. Ugh, sorry, I'm yawning. There are other areas where it's like that, too. Some of the berries are just out of reach past a fence. And it's like, why is it up there? Why do you structure it like this? Why would you let them grow berries in those areas when you can't reach them? It just makes you sad. <laughs> Whatever. At least I've gotten two. Maybe I'll get a third. That would be nice. Fuck you. Can't believe you're like that. That's so mean. <laughs> Another tree! I guess I could do this as my tapping area, if I really wanted to. You know what? Yeah, sure. Why not? We'll put trees to be tapped there instead. That'll be fun. Okay. And then there. I don't think there's any other things around here. Is there any at the entrance? No. Sag. I only got two. Even though there's a third one available, I just can't reach it. Man, that's mean. So aggressive, game. <laughs> that's really aggressive. You're so rude. Alright, let's see. You can pick up some of these seeds so I can take them over there. Oh, another tree's over here. Well, didn't even realize. Can't believe you. Fucking rude. <laughs> Is there any way to get to it? No. Man. Sucks. You're so mean, game. You're so mean. There are some... things here, but I can't tell. I think all of those ones have grown. The, uh, the maple trees or whatever. I think they've all grown. Which is really unfortunate. Wait! No, it looked like there was a difference in texture with those ones. Shoot. There was not. <laughs> well, whatever. Poop. Alright, cool. And now I can put this here. Bonk. Nice. Now we have a tapper going. Fantastic. Alright, and now we have nothing else to do. So, let's go toss these away and then sleep. How long have I been streaming? Two hours. Do I want to take a break? Kind of. Okay, I'm going to consider this break time. I'm gonna stop. Yeah, exit to desktop. Do we want to do that? Yeah. Yeah, it just saved. Okay, so I'm gonna go to the end screen. Because <coughs> I'm gonna end the stream. Because I'm tired now. And I want to do other things. Alright, so. Is that off? Um, yeah, I'm gonna go eat and just chill out for a while. Probably, probably play uh, Cookie Run Kingdom for a bit, because I've been really into playing that. 
But yeah, I'm gonna go. It's been fun. Two hours of just playing Stardew. It was really chill, actually. Uh, I need to get better at making myself relax more while I play, but I still haven't found a really comfortable sitting position when I stream. I need to figure that out. But yeah, anyways, I'm gonna go. So I'll come back at some point when I feel like streaming again. I need to start doing art streams again. We got some extra batteries so that I can do the art streams for longer instead of only for two hours, which is nice. Um, so I'll probably start doing them again within the next like day or two. I don't know specifically when, but sometime soon. Probably not today. I'm a bit tired today, but like maybe tomorrow. But we'll see. Anyways, I'm gonna go. I will see you later. <laughs>